My name is Prince Jesse and I'm a visual artist from Ghana. Um, I usually tell stories which are true in the community where I grew up from. Uh, basically kids who are less privileged, who don't have access to education. And what I use my art to do is to bring that true story out so people can help or support what I'm doing with my nonprofit organization called Boss Kids. And I could have also been like those kids in um, Jamestown if I, my mom didn't, I mean, make a good living for her to be able to further my education. And so I feel like I'm a lucky person. I just feel like I could have easily been like those kids. So having this opportunity, I just think is that the best thing I can do is to use my art. feel like as kids you don't have access to certain resources because it's like way above your budget. So I started shooting on an iPhone and started expressing myself through it and as time went on I was able to afford a camera and then other things that um, have helped shape my work. I feel like it's an inspiration for people to know that you don't need all these big tools to express yourself. It's about the mind and not what you have in your hands, you know. Um, I have a condition, a neurological condition called synesthesia where I associate color with words, days of the week with alphabets, with numbers. So for example, Monday is brown, Wednesday is blue, Friday is red, Saturday is white. And so every work that I do, I associate um, the theme with a the color and, and it shows in the works that you see. When Bama reached out to me to do this series, I was inspired and um, grateful and honored to do it. The book, Le Petit Prince, I had never heard of it, but after reading it, I was so mad at myself that I didn't read that, I mean, when I was a kid. And I, I loved it so much, and that inspired me more to create around the themes of friendship, loneliness, love, and exploration. Um, what I found interesting about Le Petit Prince was like, I mean, challenging adults, um, I mean, and, and, and telling adults that it's not always what you think, you have to learn new things, you know, and, and I felt that that was very powerful. It was very important for me to bring this series to Ghana because Ghana is where I'm from. I know how important the book was to Olivier. I also wanted to give the version of what I see. Um, one thing that I loved is the relationship between Le Petit Prince and the Rose, so I decided to create a life-sized version of it. Um, I also created a rocket because, you know, obviously Le Petit Prince was in um, exploring planets. And I, just, I was just amazed seeing the models pose in front of it because it showed character, it showed someone who's curious about the, the planets and the world. One of my favorite concepts was um, um, including um, my, my, brother, my little brothers who uh, I, I took from Jamestown, the kids. Um, I put them in the series because I feel like um, Le Petit Prince could be me, it could be them, it could be someone who's um, less privileged, it could be someone who's privileged as well, it could be someone who's in the middle somewhere, someone who's trying to find their journey and their path. To me, the, the book represented like uh, exploration and, and, and de determination and then education being the, the main theme, the main uh, problem that I'm actually working towards to solve. Seeing Olivier becoming the youngest black fashion designer of a luxury house um, inspired me to use the kids because I feel like, um, I mean, the kids need to also, I mean, believe in themselves and feel they can do. There are no limits or no ceilings above anybody. You can do whatever you want to do and you can achieve whatever you want to achieve if you put your mind to it. Because Olivia showed us that there are levels and we, we still haven't reached anywhere yet. Okay, so for example, Balmar, uh, to me, B is yellow, A is red, L is white, M is gray, A is red, I is white, N is green. Yeah. It looks like I'm reading. Because yeah. <laughs> it's, it's a mental thing, so as I say it, I'm seeing it. As I was saying it right now, I was seeing it. 